My own phone? Yes. My own phone? Why do you want to see my phone? The phone that you were using inside the court. Did this you is see the phone inside, inside, inside the court. This is it. This is it. Open it, please. I will get me open what this one. Wrong? What is the problem, sir? You, you are a lawyer, right? Yes. And you know the rules. I know the question of the law. Uh, 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 of the law, inside the court. See, guy will cost this himself, God. The guy don't work out. They don't, they don't enter court already, see that.
But Nigeria. They're supposed to be live streaming your activities so that nobody doubts what is going on. <laughs> oh, I lost her. Everybody enter, enter. Let's go. Madam, can we go please? Over what? Over what? Latinas and this TVC. Oh, you mean regarding to discussion? Okay. And yeah, that's fine now. I thought.
Then you know. And that's how I was giving them back. Yeah. 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 I was giving to you and back. So, but because even the men are not here, they are going to the Are we following you? Yeah. So where are we going to now? Not a high court. Okay. Uh, okay.
Uh, guys. <laughs> so we're back. Uh, we just came out of uh, the Court of Appeal uh, here. And you guys probably watched a little bit of uh, altercation between our team and uh, the police people there who were trying to seize our phone. They said that uh, they have to collect our phone and delete what they claim was the footage uh, that showed some of the, uh, our going in and out of the courtroom. Of course, they have no right <clears throat> to collect our phone or delete anything. And this has always been what we stand for for Nigerians. You know, Nigerians have become so used to uh, being told to do what is wrong. And the people who do what is wrong have seen doing what is wrong as a norm. And they hate transparency. They hate for us to let people see what's going on, see their faces, because the tribe and the opaqueness of uh, of the way they conduct businesses um, to the point that they've gotten used to it. So, as you guys saw, the police people tried to collect and delete our phone, which is unacceptable. Um, I asked them to bring their boss when the boss eventually came and the chief registrar of the court came out. They were just pleading that we should leave. Uh, there was no reason for anybody to have asked to delete our phone or delete our footage. So we have left. Uh, but the, what happened in court today is of course part of uh, what we've been complaining about. We went to court since last year, submitted uh, our appeal to the court. The government was served. The government lawyers were served. They did not reply to the appeal. Then they did something strange uh, and illegal or uh, unethical. They went and filed a preliminary objection, what they call the PO, to our appeal, which does not, which is not even acceptable. All authorities have condemned this practice. And they know it, but they want to use it to delay the trial because they didn't file an appeal. Probably they couldn't file an appeal. But in a way, the agenda is to keep delaying the case and delaying me here in Abuja uh, for as long as possible because they don't have a case. And uh, they have realized that they are the ones on trial. So whatever they can do they, to keep us delayed here, they keep doing it uh, in the most unfortunate manner. And uh, that's why they're always edgy when they see us because they had expected that I would run away and not come to court again so that they can be using that to uh, claim that uh, I was the one who didn't want to be tried. But I didn't run away. I refused to run away. It's my country. I was born here. And as they say, we die here together. But we won't do so without a cause, without a purpose. So we will continue to push for the very powerful revolutionary demands and requests and uh, attention that all these urgent matters of uh, our nation requires until we get it there's no backing down so uh, that's our that's that's that was what happened over there so the case was adjourned till july 8th to enable the government that had not filed all this well and you remember i told you all this rig my rule is being done to give them more time just to delay and give them time to file their frivolous appeal, whether it's merit, you know, whether it has merit or is meritless, that's what they want to do. But we are ready, and uh, we are using this opportunity to um, tell our people not to be scared, not to back down, and not to be tired. Recently, a hashtag was trending called "We Are Tired." I have a little problem with that hashtag, you know, so, because. If you are tired of oppression, you just don't stay tired there and not do something about it. You stand up and fight. So I am not very enamored with another, you know, hashtag that is seeking sympathy. People have to go way beyond hashtag now and start dealing with their problem of oppression. Everybody. So we will get there, Odion. Thank you so much. The maker is here, but see you stella maka thank you so so much all of you oh my la i'm gonna
Uh, thank you, Stan Mega. Um, we, I don't think um, I understand what you know, he's trying to say, but oh, it's a free word. Shagun Mosha is watching as uh, my brother out there, Felicia Akins. Um, Mary Money, Fadumo, Shibuke, Pasca, uh, Toyin, Adeyemi. I keep getting this question about Udua. I've uh, said it clearly. I'm not interested in the breakup of Nigeria. Because when you break up Nigeria, you are still going to go to fight the same revolution that we are refusing to fight now. You will fight it when you get to Odudua, uh, the Odudua nation. But I do not discountenance uh, those who are asking for self-determination. I don't have any problem against people who feel tired of the way things are going on. And like I keep saying, that's their own very simple way of asking for a revolution. Yeah. So, but I'm not. I know. I know the intricacies. I know the nuances behind those who are asking for the Dua Republic. They are the same failed politicians. Some of them. There are some of you who are genuinely looking for, you know, your country that you can, where you can survive and not be discriminated against. But uh, having done this for 30 years, I know, I know where, I know an original matter when I say one, and I know there are a lot of nuances I will discuss over time. So we have gone to come to another court to obtain all of the court uh, documents needed uh, for uh, continuous uh, trial. Where is it? <laughs> <laughs> Koro <laughs> 